our world is filled with animals that want nothing more than to rip us apart limb from limb, and yet so many people want to see them up close. Well, there are some animals that you should be running away from, and we have a handy list for ya. From one of nature's apex predators to an animal even Liam Neeson struggled the fight. Here are 15 dangerous animals you should run away from. <laughs> <sighs> Number 15. Saltwater Crocodile I think this one's pretty obvious. This is not the kind of creature you should be petting or writing cute children's books about. Run. The saltwater croc is one of the most opportunistic and dangerous animals in the world. This apex predator can cause an unbelievable amount of pain and suffering to its prey, ambushing its target and drowning or swallowing it whole. By the way, that prey includes everything from fish to birds, mammals, including humans and other apex predators, like sharks. Where do the saltwater crocs find sharks, you may be asking? I don't know, that's why you should be running away from them. These animals are not just big lizards, they're basically walking death machines you won't be walking away from an encounter with them. The saltwater croc can grow up to 20 feet long and weigh up to 2,900 pounds. I don't think I really need to say too much more than that, right? This thing is just... It's not your friend, man. Real friends don't ambush, drown, and swallow you whole. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. It's time for the rare topic. Now I'm gonna be very upfront and say this is horrific. The Titan Beetle is a pretty horrific, very big, no good beetle that's incredibly dangerous to humans. While they're not inherently aggressive towards humans, they're known to have incredibly sharp spines and jaws that are strong enough to cut into human flesh. So basically, you should be running in the opposite direction as soon as you see one of these things. But I imagine you knew that already, right? What do you think of this thing? An incredible insect or a freak of of nature. Comment down below with the hashtag rare topic and let us know your opinion in relation to what we just showed on screen. With that said, let's keep things moving. Number 14. Wolves there's a common misconception that wolves are just wild dogs that can be domesticated and reformed into cute, cuddly friends. This is not the case. Or mostly not the case. Wolves are incredibly dangerous animals, and you should absolutely avoid coming into contact with them if you can. Although that seems like common sense, really. Thankfully, over time, wolves have come to live far from humans and have even developed the habit of avoiding us whenever possible. Still, there are incidents of fatal wolf attacks, with France recording an unbelievable 7,600 fatal attacks between the years 1,200 and 1920. Between 1952 and 2000 alone, there were three deadly attacks in North America, eight in Russia and Europe, and more than 200 in South Asia. That's a lot of people who did not heed my advice. If you see a wolf, get running! Some wolves also carry the added nightmare of rabies, meaning that a single bite can turn into a very long and agonizing experience. So to reiterate what I've been saying from the very beginning, if you even see a wolf in person, please God, Start running. Number 13. Boom Slang There's a lot more to the boom slang than just a funny name. This snake is one of the most deadly in the world. And for a few reasons, none of them sadly have anything to do with the name. I triple checked. Lovely, eh? Stunning. Look at that, eh? The boom slang is a snake mostly found in South Africa and is known for its extraordinary genetic talents. Obviously, we have those huge fangs, but those aren't too surprising on dangerous snakes. We also have those eyes, which grant the boom slang with eyesight much better than those of most snakes, and apparently almost as good as your average human being. This gifted eyesight helps the snake pick passing birds right out of the air, but they also have a unique brand of venom that, when injected, can kill in a matter of hours 
powers. If a human was bitten by a boomslang, they would have no chance of escaping. This venom makes you bleed from every orifice of your body. That includes eyes, ears, and, well, I think you know where else. You're probably thinking, well, what about the anti-venom? The only place in South Africa that has boomslang anti-venom is Johannesburg. So if you happen to be attacked out in the bush, bad luck. Number 12. Hippopotamus Cartoons have trained us to view the hippo as a big, cuddly, slightly stupid animal. Nothing could be further from the truth. These are dangerous, violently, and wildly unpredictable animals, and we should all be very, very cautious of them. The hippopotamus reportedly kills more humans on- That is, an unimaginable amount of people being killed by these huge, huge animals. And it makes sense when you think about it. The experts know when these animals are ticked off, they can see the signs, but the clueless wilderness explorers and tourists have no idea. So when these animals decide to charge at those intruders, it very rarely works out for the accidental trespasser. And by that, I mean they're basically flattened like a wily e. coyote cartoon, but without the cartoon whimsy. The best thing to do with the hippo is to watch from a distance or just stay the heck away from them. These animals do not want to be your friend. They want to run you down and get back to their beloved bath time. I have family members who do the same thing. Number 11. Leopard. Again, this shouldn't come as a surprise to anybody, but big cats are among the most dangerous animals in the world, capable of ripping our puny human bodies limb from limb. The leopard is no different. It's a stealthy and incredibly adaptable cat, and that's bad news for us walking meat stacks. Leopard attacks have gone on for centuries, with early man often coming into contact with these violent animals attacking their livestock. But the attacks seem to peak during the late 19th and early 20th centuries as the world moved into a period of cities and urbanization. Of course, in India, the threat of leopards continues to be a significant one. Thanks to deforestation and the lack of natural prey, some leopards are moving into cities and towns searching for food. And the advice for residents is similar to what I've been saying all along. If you see one, run the hell away. These animals are opportunistic, they can adapt to any environment and take any chance they can to get some food for themselves. Even if that means eating your dog. Yes, they eat dogs. Quick, everyone get on Twitter, we're canceling leopards. Number 10. African Cape Buffalo if you've never heard of or seen the African Cape Buffalo, congratulations. That may well be why you're still alive today. The African Cape Buffalo also goes by a different and much more ominous name, the Black Death. And that name is pretty fitting. <laughs> The African Cape Buffalo was one of the most dangerous animals in Africa, commonly believed to have killed more big game hunters than any other animal on the continent. And for a continent like Africa, which is full of animals looking to kill ya, that's a heck of a statement. These buffalo can reach up to 6 feet tall and weigh as much as 1,750 pounds. So you can imagine what happens when a big game hunter misses a shot and can't run so fast. Yeah, he doesn't get back up. Sorry, buddy, that'll teach you to hunt animals, I guess. As if that's not terrifying enough, the African Cape Buffalo doesn't like working alone. So if you happen to take it off enough, you're going to be faced with a mob of angry buffalo charging at you with a speed of up to 35 miles per hour. And that's why they're called the Black Death. Don't hunt animals, kids. Number 9. Hyenas Hyenas are often thought of as laughing devils, and that's not too far from reality, actually. According to one animal expert, the worst possible way to die is getting devoured by these nightmarish beings. And judging by my research, that's not an unreasonable conclusion. Generally speaking, hyenas very rarely feed on humans. They actually tend to be very wary of us and leave the human killing to other bigger animals. However, they're most definitely capable of doing so and have been known to attack humans if food is scarce. And according to that animal expert, their method of killing is sharp and brutal. 
and without going into horrific details, you'd still be alive to experience it. Not a fun time for anybody, so I think it's a given that you should start running at even the slightest sound of a hyena nearby. As is the case with almost every species, the female is significantly stronger and more dangerous than the male, but their joy of killing is no different. These are just nightmarish, psychotic animals from start to finish, and the Lion King got it absolutely right. Number 8. Sloth Bear The sloth bear may sound like a cute and harmless, even slow animal, but it really isn't. After all, it's a bear, and not the cute teddy bear kind. I'm talking the dangerous, possibly violent Winnie the Pooh type bear. Be afraid. Be kind of afraid. The sloth bear can be found in forests across Asia, and is known to thrive in various habitats as long as it can find food. <laughs> This bear's food of choice is pretty standard, actually. Ants, termites, the usual small bugs. So it's fair to say that these bears don't want to eat humans. However, they have been known to attack humans during unwanted or unexpected encounters. In one part of India, 11 people were killed by these bears in just 30 months. So while they may not be yet to eat us, they're still one of the most dangerous animals in Asia. The sloth bear is another example of an animal's name being much cuter than the animal in question, you go in expecting a cute little sloth-like animal, and instead get a bear that will claw your face off if it can. Just like Winnie the Pooh then. Number 7. Lions if the words, you should avoid contact with lions is news to you, then frankly it's a miracle you're still with us. Lions are unquestionably one of the most dangerous animals on our planet. You should always be avoiding direct contact with them. At this point, this topic is just a formality. A lion's diet is vast and varied, ranging from rodents and baboons to hippopotamuses, zebras, and water buffalo. <coughs> they will basically eat anything they can get their paws on, whether they were the ones who killed the animals or not. All that matters to the lion is getting a good meal, which obviously is bad news for us humans, as we've spent so long eating McDonald's and buttered products that we're all tasty and fat. So yeah, we're on the lion's to-eat list for sure. Sorry about that, guys. Humans should always be running away from big cats like lions. It's not even a question. If they can catch you, they will absolutely attack, kill, and eventually eat ya. And you don't want your life's legacy to end with killed by a lion because I disobeyed an online video, right? Number 6. Cassowary It's time we addressed the deadliest bird on Earth, the cassowary. This thing is an absolute nightmare, especially if you're already a little bit wary of or dislike birds. Pigeons and swans may be jerks, but this animal is a straight-up murderer. The cassowary is most well-known for its talons, which are said to be so strong that they could actually disembowel a human being. And while that hasn't happened yet, many stories illustrate the damage and harm they can do to our frail human skin. Cassowaries have been reported to have infiltrated people's homes and attacked when they weren't fed, with one story ending with the bird knocking an adult man's door down and slicing his jugular vein in one swipe. I mean, that's the kind of thing you see from mafia bosses, not birds. I can see the movie now. The God feather. What's even worse is that the cassowary is also known to attack whenever it feels threatened, which, let's be honest, could be pretty much any moment. In summary, you probably are at risk of a cassowary attack right now. These birds are psychos, so get some food ready and change the locks. Number 5. Yellow-Bellied Sea Snake in old-timey English, yellow-bellied meant that you were a coward. So the natural question to ask is, is the yellow-bellied sea snake a coward? Because even the name sounds like an insult from pirate days. The answer, of course, is a big old no, me hearties. The yellow-bellied sea snake is surprisingly beautiful, but it's by no means harmless. Unlike most other snake species, this little guy is usually found lurking in the sea and hunts at times of day, which is one of the scariest things about it, really. Thankfully for us, this snake doesn't tend to attack humans unless they get too close, but when they do attack, oh boy, do they. 
the yellow-bellied sea snake is filled with venom and poison that is… somehow worse than any other snake. It's often been said that just one drop of this poison can kill three grown men. So if you can't handle your drink now, the difference with this venom is that it actually attacks the respiratory system and the usual venom targets, as well as your muscles. It's one of the most brutal ways to die imaginable. You can't move, but you can feel your body dying, so I guess in conclusion you should probably get the heck away from these guys. That seems like solid advice. Number 4. Elephants Everybody in the animal kingdom has great respect for elephants. They're incredibly smart, they're beautiful animals, they're basically just wonderful. However, they're also very dangerous and can cause injury if you happen to do something that angers them. Dumbo is not reflective of elephants at large, is what I'm trying to say. Several instances would prompt an elephant to hurt a human. but there are really three that are most common. One is simple. You try and hunt these animals, they might get angry and start charging toward you. In this case, you deserved it. The other is that you got a little too close to their child or threatened harm toward it. They'll start charging you. Again, you kinda had it coming. The third is that they're raiding a nearby village or cropland and you're trying to stop them. They'll charge you. In this case, it's not really your fault, but I'm not gonna tell an elephant that. It'll kill me. On average, anyone where between 100 and 500 humans are killed every year due to elephant rage. Their sheer size and weight is more than enough to kill ya. Also, they can't fly, so that movie is just one lie after another. Number 3. Fear Okay, stick with me on this one. I promise I haven't lost my mind. Not totally, anyway. Obviously, deer are not the kind of animals that are going to eat us or intentionally cause us any harm. However, they are kind of dangerous in their own adorably clueless sort of way. Deer are actually responsible for an unbelievable amount of road accidents. To be specific, one insurance provider claims that hundreds of thousands of car accidents in the United States every year result from deer. They run out in the middle of the road, send the car careening into another vehicle or some kind of physical structure, and before you know it, you have injuries or you have some lawsuits. So yeah, deer are actually a dangerous animal in their own way. We just choose to ignore it because they're so gosh darn cute. I guess the conclusion here is that you should be very wary when driving in an area popular with deer. If possible, get out of there as safely as you possibly can. Because these little dudes are so clueless, they might actually kill you and not even know about it. Number 2. Tigers Again, it's no surprise why this animal is on our list. The tiger is a notorious predator for a reason. It's the largest member of the cat family, and it's one of the most formidable predators anywhere in the world. It's not even a competition, really. It's a three-year-old tigress that has just arrived to the park. Tigers have a long and notorious history when it comes to humans. In India alone, there have been countless incidents that saw humans being attacked by tigers at zoos for placing their hands into the enclosures. Although, to be fair, what did they expect? However, these animals are even more prevalent in the world, where people cluelessly wander into the animal's natural environment and find themselves attacked by one of nature's most unpredictable predators. It's estimated that between 50 and 250 50 people are killed by tigers every year in Indian forests. I mean, what more evidence do you need to stay away from the woods? Tigers are beautiful animals, of course, but they're dangerous. It goes without saying that you should not be sticking your hands through their cages and that you should be running in the opposite direction if you happen to see one. Otherwise, you're only asking for trouble, and trouble is not always fun. Number 1. Brown Bear Bears are agile and fast-moving animals. The brown bear is no exception to that rule. Just because he once lived in a big blue house and sang songs doesn't mean he won't kill you and feel good about it. The brown bear is one of the largest living bears on the planet, rivaled only by its closest relative, the polar bear, which incidentally is the most dangerous on the planet, so I guess this kind of brutal terror is just the family business. Like many of the great predators of our world, the brown bear will will eat pretty much anything, though they prefer to eat vegetation. However, these are opportunistic predators and will take whatever they can get their paws on. That includes other animals, mammals, bears, even garbage. They're not fussy eaters at all. 
That's kind of the point. The brown bear has often been used as a circus animal, leading many to believe that they're innocent or harmless. That's probably why so many people all over the world have been killed by these formidable predators. Newsflash people, they don't ride bicycles for fun. I don't think he even lives in the big blue house anymore. Which of these animals do you think is the most deadly? And have you ever seen any of them for yourself? Let us know in the comments. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time.